Hey friends, I hope you're all doing so fantastic today. My name is Zach Rizal, back with a brand new Marvel Snap video, and today, this is my Infinity deck. This deck got me right to Infinity, and what it makes this deck so, so strong is Evo. This is the main guy, Evo. He unlocks the true potential and abilities of cards that don't necessarily have them to begin with. For example, Hulk, when you end your turn with unspent energy, plus two power. Cyclops, when you end your turn with unspent energy, you flick two enemy cards here with negative one power, and then Misty Knight, unspent energy, give one of your other cards plus one power. And so, the reason what makes this deck so good is because we can throw down magic whenever we want. We throw it down, right? We get, then we get those those untapped cards out there like your Cyclops, your Misty. And then on six, you float, right? You completely skip your turn on six. And then you could throw down a free She-Hulk. And depending on who's stronger, Infinite or Hulk, because Hulk can get up to 22, sometimes even 24. You have a free She-Hulk. You have a Hulk and an Infinite that you can throw down on seven. Sometimes it's a 30 Four thirty-two power play, which is an absolute mega swing at the end of the game. And so what else do we have in here, right? We have Sunspot because, we, again, on spent energy, he gets up to 10 power sometimes, which for a one drop is crazy. Nebula, one of the best, if not the best one drop in the game. Not only does she scale insanely, but she also acts as an element of control and really, really can really hurt your opponent if he lets her get away. Misty and I, as we talked about, magic, Cosmo, a little bit of tech, right? Stop those arm reveals. No blobs, no, no, no Thanos is all that, stones, no more. Get it out of here. Kyra, she is so, so strong. Dare I call her the queen of tech. She protects all your one and six cost cards. So your Nebula, your Sunspot, your Misty, She-Hulk, Infinite, and Hulk are all protected. Shang-Chi, get out of here. Cyclops, as we talked about. Haivo, this variant is so amazing. Enchantress, another tech card. Miss Marvel's running Rampage, so it's Zabu. And all those ongoing tribunal decks, get them out of here. Just get them out of here. And then She-Hulk, Hulk, and Infinite. I mean, this deck is just absolutely insane. It, and there's a reason why it's so good. It's it's just crazy. It, it's not hard to run. And it's just super, super effective by throwing down that 30-something power play on 7. So with that being said, let's get right into some gameplay. I really appreciate you guys watching this. It means the absolute world. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And let's do this, guys. Let's get right into Infinity. Good luck on your climbs. I'll talk to you all soon. Snap out, guys. Oh yeah, bring back Chavez on six. Maybe soon, right? Bring back Chavez on six. So now it's turn four here. So we get the magic, which is amazing. Um, I don't know if I want to change the middle. We'll probably keep the middle. We'll snap into this. We have a really, really, we have our play line, right? We have the She-Hulk, we have the Infinite, we have the magic out. We have everything going that we need, that we need, right? So we're going to snap into that. Let's see what our opponent does here. Throws in the Kyra. He has a variant, which is amazing. So, so amazing. So, Misty Knight triggers. So does Cyclops, right? And this is where the deck really starts to get hectic. Really, really hectic. Uh, we don't have Pryo, unfortunately. But we will do this. We'll throw it on Nebula just to get it out of there. And we will have an extra energy. So, we'll throw that on the Cyclops. We don't really care about the rocks. We don't. We have everything we need. There's the Marvel. Okay, so we get the sunspot out. Okay, now we're just gonna float, right? Now we just float. Sunspot's gonna get plus six power, and then we have a She-Hulk and an Infinite ready to go on lock. Here we go. Gets the Kazar out. And there's a Korg. We're getting pumped full of rocks a little bit. That's gonna switch out. And he gets a sunspot back. Okay. Okay, this is good. And now we just uh right now we have our play. We have everything ready to go. And so we have the extra one. So we can throw down the infinite for six. We have the free She-Hulk, and then we have an extra energy to trigger the effect again. And so we're just gonna throw down the She-Hulk on left. We have the infinite on right, and we go from there. There's the loot cage. There's the Ant-Man. That rotates out for a rock, unfortunately for him. <laughs> and then there's She-Hulk. So we're winning left. There's the Infinite. And then everything triggers all over again. Sunspot goes up by one. Misty Knight triggers. Wow. What, I mean, <laughs> what a deck, guys. What a crazy deck. All right, so we're into another game here. Here we go. We have the Hulk in our hand already, which is fantastic. So you guys can see the true potential of how this works. Hulk's already at 14. And if we keep using the unspent energy... Hulk will only get higher and higher and higher. He has a Lyoth, which could be good for us. We skip again. We can't play. Selene's going to hit our Lyoth, which is not a big deal. It's fine. 
Not even our card to begin with. So it's okay. Hulk's already at 16. We have the magic. Okay. I would like to do Cyclops now. Ashford M is going to clog us up a little bit. So instead of actually throwing the Cyclops down now, we can just throw the magic down. Stop all that Asteroid M nonsense. There's the Jeff. Okay. So now we can just throw down the Cyclops here. I want to get that Jeff down. I want to get it down to very, very little power, maybe even negative power. That'd be ideal. He'll be forced to move it early. So that's what we're going to do here. So we conjures middle, gets rid of that squirrel. We're gonna blast that Jeff, force him to get that Jeff out of there. Okay, so now we're, now we're gonna throw down Kyra just in case he has anything a little spicy, right? That can like a Killmonger or anything like that, like can or Shang Chi maybe. So we're gonna throw that down. Nebula would be good here, but I think Sunspot is just overall better play. All right, so he moves the Jeff early, right? That's good for us. There's a Kyra. Okay, so there's the Hobgob. We're going to be able to bring that lane back just a little bit. Just a little bit. So we have to float again here, right? We just have to float. All right, so we know he has a life which is very, very dangerous for us. I think our only play here is She-Hulk. Our only play here is She-Hulk, and the reason why I want to float the rest of the energy is because we'll win the right with the Sunspot. So we'll just throw down the She-Hulk on left. There's the Eliath. Ooh, brother. <laughs> so we get the Fortune on left, Sunspot goes up, the, the plus six, and then we win the game. See you later, Lyoth. Get out of here. We wouldn't want to be a brother. Let's go. Come on, guys. All right, so we're into another game here. We have the Nebula off rip, which is great. We'll throw it on the right. We don't want to play Hala because um, that Nebula is just going to be very weak. It's going to keep playing that and we'll probably get destroyed. So we don't want to do, we don't want to do that. We don't want that. We have Throne Room. Okay, that could be very, very, very beneficial for us. We'll throw down the Misty right and... Uh, we have an extra energy, so Hulk's going to get beefed up. And Missy's going to hit the Nebula. Skips again. Okay, so we do have the Pryo. We do have to throw the Kyra now, just in case anything happens, right? So we'll throw on the Kyra on the... We'll do the middle here. We'll do the middle. We'll just, hopefully he doesn't play left here. He does play left. All right, so our Enchantress is gone. That's okay. I mean, I don't really know what he's running yet, so. It's a wave. And the Kyra, okay. So our Enchantress is gone. That's okay. He snapped. He's probably going to throw down a blob in the middle. So we can counter that with the Cosmo. Oh, what a read. What a read. <laughs> a four power blob. Sorry, brother. That's uh, that's my bad. That's my bad. And so uh, now we're still a little, it's still not totally secured. Uh, I would like the wave. Uh, GG, brother. Okay, nice. Good read. There we go.